All right, people, welcome back. Uh, last time I saw you was the Riverside 50K, which uh, didn't go so well for us. Sucks. That's, you know, that was a big event I was planning for this year. And that kind of stuff happens in drifting. You just got to deal with it, move on, get over it, and keep on keeping on. So uh, today is test and tune kind of a fun weekend at gld they were doing friday saturday and sunday well of course i've been busy all weekend i've been trying to kind of get the shop organized doesn't look like it but uh, i've been doing some stuff i got a uh, tire machine finally see that so i got to rearrange some stuff i want to try and get that put in the trailer but uh don't really feel like driving this car today honestly uh, it's cost a lot of money. I only have so many tires. Tires are getting more expensive. So I'm going to drive my blue car. So we're getting loaded up right now. Uh, I think they're doing a little uh, daily drift bro down competition today. Uh, ground's a little wet. I think it's supposed to rain all day. So that's going to be the better car to bring for that. And it's just something for fun. But I figured, you know been a while since i got some seat time been practicing a lot on the sim been riding my motorcycle a lot getting my head right after 50k got really sick there by the way so did everybody super spreader so uh <laughs> yeah i don't know i guess uh just a fun day of some some uh seat time some practice drifting so see what this thing can do today all right just got to gld uh some confusion at the gate whether or not they're still open it always happens on weekend events especially these three-day ones but uh so yeah got the old piece of crap ready to go figure out a way to mount my phone in here somewhere so you guys can hopefully come along and check it out but we gotta drive let's do it all right, so this car does not have a very good spot to mount my phone. So unfortunately, you guys are probably gonna be a little shaky because I got you up there on the old shit handle. So uh, hopefully you don't fly out the window. We'll give her a go, see what happens. A lot of grip in some spots and no grip in other spots. Not in very good spots either. So we're going to roll with it. Also, I crashed the shit out of this car and had to bend back the steering arm so my alignment's definitely not correct. Thank <laughs> you. 
This is a lot of fun, I will say. from rotating so much. I'm so used to having to use the foot brake all the time on my brown car. It's like when I get into this thing, I always want to stab foot brake and it's not really the best thing because it wants to spin the car around. Brake bias is definitely different between this one and that car. My temp gauge hasn't even moved. This is great. <laughs> oh my god, I heard you fucking screaming over there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's it's so much fun. Dude, your your timing, you figured out where all the uh, the spots are. Yeah. Like dude it's now. It's yeah. cake. Oh, get the yeah. wall pussy. Huh? Get the wall pussy. Yeah, I don't know. Just uh, right walk up to it with the handbrake. Just give it a little Yeah. Bigger run up, bigger run up. 
problem is I'm running out of gear in second and it's too far away from third. Check this out. Trust me to tell it was already like that. <laughs> Look at that. Perfect little wall touch. Oh man. That's beautiful. So Brad was telling me they heard a metal scrape. Yep, definitely got the exhaust a little bit too. Oh man, that is beautiful. Alright, I got my little wall tap out of the way. So now we're just gonna work on line, I guess. I really don't want to total the back end of this car, so.
Look at that Supra. I want one of those so bad. On the TEs? Oh my God. Beautiful car. Well, it's starting to rain. before I was kind of praying for rain just because this thing is normally a little too gripped up <clears throat> but of course now I was getting used to it and I was having a lot of fun and now it's raining now everything is going to kind of slow down Plus now it's going to be way hotter in my car because I can't keep the windows wide open and the sunroof. It is what it is. <laughs> Brad told me he wants to see a really long wall drag, so we're gonna try for that. I guess we're about to do that competition. I'm going to chase first. I'm up against Bob. So, uh, yeah, let's have some fun. Who's saying go? Adam. Mm-hmm. 
my car. But I think that puts me at a big advantage right now. Ah, put it back together. You can pull up if you want. I'm gonna I'm gonna go from here, I think. a bunch of rocks at him. So we won that battle. We got this, uh, I think it's a V6 Mustang for the next battle. So this should be interesting. My biggest problem with that guy was that I could not hear that guy, Bob, was that I couldn't hear my car at all over his car. So uh, this guy said he's got mufflers on here. So hopefully I can actually keep it where I want to in the RPM this time, but let's do it. got the win on that one so we're in the finals this is dope this is so much fun actually just like it's it's very low pressure compared to the stuff that I'm used to 
I kind of threw myself into a bunch of high pressure competition shit and now all of a sudden it's like you know this is the kind of stuff I really enjoy obviously still enjoy the high pressure stuff but there's a lot less on the line in terms of morning and everything and oh man I mean perfect conditions to use the blue shitter as my comp car this is great so all right we got a 350z in the final so we'll see how that goes starting to get kind of a little bit more grippy okay. but it's still really wet right where the car is like on this section okay it looks like it's starting to grip up a little bit but it's still really wet right here coming around back took it old girl did it Woo! hell yeah that was good good battle I'm stoked on that Woo! this car feels so much better I put this gigantic air filter on it because I had one of those little mushroom filters on it before and it like it's always felt like it's being choked out the uh, air filter that was on it when we got it was like really dirty so I put I put this one on or I put the mushroom filter on and it, the car never felt like it had full power and now it's just like feels like a rocket ship compared to what it was so pretty stoked car feels great and uh it was a lot of fun thanks to Adam for putting this on dude this is so much so much fun like these you can see how these guys are progressing like this is yeah. awesome it was so. a tough track I was super oh, patchy oh yeah was super really, patchy like, ripped up and then really wet yeah. so Hell yeah. Everyone go well. Awesome, dude. Congrats, dude. Thanks. This is like a seto in real life. I'm literally going until I'm going to run out of gas. <laughs> I started the day with a half tank and now I'm under a quarter, so. Fuel's getting sucked up quicker than the tires are. <laughs> Yeah, dude. 
Swing that shit right where I'm trying to go. Oh no, my gaslight's on. <laughs> 